Hello everybody, your favorite gamer here, and today's video, I am going to be playing some Minecraft. And today in Minecraft, I will be doing a Minecraft command block tutorial. So I'm going to be showing you guys how to do title commands, subtitle commands, tell raw commands, and the simple say command. Okay, so let's get started and giving ourselves a command block and a button. So if you don't know how to give yourself a command block, do slash give at P C O M M tab enter. And that is how you give yourself a command block. Okay, so with the title command, that's what that looks like. The subtitle commands, tell raw, and the say. So let's get started with the title command. So if we enter here, okay, you have to be in creative to do the the commands and enter the command blocks or yeah so we do title at p title curly bracket or curly brace or bracket or whatever you want to say quotation mark text quote colon quote and then whatever you want to say so let's name it title close it off with another quote and if you want to add a custom color you just do comma color oh here before I get to that if you want to just end it there you just close it off with that that's all you have to do but if you want to add a color comma quote comma quote color quote colon quote and the color you want some of the colors I know that will not work is orange purple of any sort so no magenta no violet None of those sorts. No invisible, because, yeah, that's just, that's just ridiculous. But you can do dark red, dark blue, green, gold, yellow. You can do a, a, a variety of colors. So let's go ahead and do dark underscore red, colon, curly bracket. Go ahead and place our button, and you can see. You can also add like bolds, like all you have to do is that, then bold, that, and true, and then that, oh, I forgot to add that, okay, and now you can see that the text is bolded, you can do italics, you can do strike throughs, you can do um, underlines, you can just, you can also make the red jumbled text, but yeah, that's all you have to do. You just have to do comma, quotation mark, bold, italic, strike through, underline, then quote, colon, quote, true, quote, and close it off with a square or curly bracket. On to the subtitle command. So let's just go ahead and copy this. So control C or control A, control C. Control V, then all we have to do is go to our title, where the second title, so if you're at the beginning, it's title app, he title, change that title to subtitle, okay, and you can just keep all of this the same, and then on top of that, or next to it, wherever, just Control V, and you're fine, and you can just get rid of this text and put a space, okay. And uh, if you're wondering what version version I'm in, I am in Minecraft 1.10.2 Vanilla. Okay. Let's go ahead and click the button, and you can see that it is bolded, but it is much smaller than the title command because it is, of course, the subtitle. You can see the difference. One is bigger. One. This one's bigger. Sorry. So yeah, this one's bigger, this one's smaller, just because that's how subtitles and titles work. Or you don't even have to have that one, you can just have it all in this one, and then it just pops up both. Next is the tell raw command, okay? So what you want to do, it's pretty much the same thing as the title and subtitle commands, you just do tell raw at p, square or curly bracket, colon, text not test text uh, quote colon quote and you can do tell raw 
quote and the same colors apply for Taylor Raw as well. You can do color if you don't forget your quote color and then let's do green not green green and you can also do no he can't eh, I don't know if he can let's let's try bold okay I can spell true you should be able to since it's the same rules Okay, yeah, you can do bold as well. You can do a tile X, you can do underline. For underline, I think you just type in underline. Okay, no. <laughs> I don't know about the underline, but you can you can still do underline and strike throughs and all that other stuff like that. So yeah, that's how you do tail raw. And the most simplest one of all is the say command. So you just enter your command block, say, you type in say, and just whatever you want. You can say ASDF, okay, uh, movie, movie 17, I don't know. Go ahead and place your button. The only thing bad about this is the at symbol, which you can change, and you can't change the color of the text. So if you just go ahead and grab your trusty anvil and okay you just go ahead and rename this sucker and command block you can name it to you can name it to server if you wanted to now let's go ahead and destroy that place your command block down and do say and then you can do the server is rebooting in 10 minutes so and then go ahead and place down your command block and you can see the server is rebooting in 10 minutes so that is how you do the title command that's how you do the title commands subtitle commands tell raw and say Okay, so we're gonna go over real quick, just a nice little flyby. So you title at p title curly bracket col or quote text quote colon quote tight or whatever you want to say. Um, whoopsies. Uh, okay, and alt tab. That's the best thing ever. Uh, colon or quote sorry comma quote. And if you want to add a color, that's what you do. Then color colon or quote colon quote the color you want quote comma quote if you want a strike through underline bold italic then quote colon quote true then at the end of the true it's a, col or a quote and then a curly curly bracket and that's how you get this the dark red bolded title command the subtitle command is just as easy. All you're doing is adding the subtitle or the sub in front of the title, and that's all you have to do. With the tell raw, it's pretty much the same thing as the title commands. So you just type in tell raw at p curly bra brace uh, quote text quote colon quote you're choosing of words quote comma quote the color or color quote colon quote the color you wish quote comma quote bold italic straight through underline doesn't matter colon quote true quote and then you close it off with the curly bracket and for the say command it is just as simple as saying typing in say and you're choosing a words and you all you have to do to change it to where it says this, this where it says server instead of at the at sign you just go ahead and rename your command block so let's get rid of these and of course my game keeps exiting because I don't know why but if you guys have enjoyed this little tutorial and maybe found this helpful then a like and a like rating would be very very uh, appreciated and it helps me know that you like these little tutorials 
about command blocks because it shows that you're interested in this little computer craft crap even though it's not a mod yeah i hope you guys have enjoyed and i hope to be seeing y'all in the next video so yeah bye bye guys